for the test for the PSR solicitation, one of the requirements is that you make a squibbed round, which is putting a 300 grain Sierra like this down the barrel. We're going to beat it in so far so that the case will still go in. We can chamber around. Then we're going to fire around behind the squib round. So what we're going to do now is pound it into the into the right the the uh, to the chamber. Which I don't like to do, but here it goes. Let's go down further. more. Okay, we're good to go. Okay, now we're going to put attach it to the shooting stand. It's already in our fixture for test firing all rifles. Retaining the rifle in position. We're going to put it on safety. We're going to fire it with a lanyard. We loaded one round behind the squib round. So now we're going to turn on the coolant. We're going to hook up a lanyard. And it is on safe. All the guys outside. Okay, I'm gonna take safety off. Huh? Magazine stayed in. Okay, let's uh, let's take it apart. And see what. What we got here? Okay. Did it? It didn't. Uh, didn't knock out the magazine. Wouldn't eject the shell. Blew the back of it out. The primer, of course, but it's not flattened out. And uh. Didn't hurt the, didn't hurt the uh, rings. Bolt face looks good. So now we'll probe it and see if there's a, a round stuck in the barrel. And blew the round out of the barrel. So next, we'll fire, we'll fire a regular round just like there's nothing wrong. Okay, I'm going to chamber around. And uh, put on some headgear here. You guys ready? Ejected perfectly, brass looks good. We'll look at the barrel later. 
But that's with a squib brown in a barrel and 338 Lapua for the SPR solicitation. And I doubt if there's another gun that can do just what we did.